Hi, I am Malin Sandstrom, and I'm the Community Engagement Officer for INCF. This is actually my 10th year running as an org admin. INCF is working for international collaboration in the field of neuroinformatics. That's the field that aims to make neuroscience research more trustworthy, reproducible, and useful by using informatics. INCF was established by the OECD in 2005. Today we have members all over the world. We were created because neuroscience had and still has a data problem. Research datasets are very rapidly becoming bigger and more complex. There's a lack of methods and tools and infrastructure to handle this problem. What we're trying to do in the INCF community is to make neuroscience datasets and other research outputs more compatible and interoperable across the world. We help our community collaborate on solutions for research data, mostly software tools, computational infrastructure, and we exchange knowledge with each other and with top research labs and major universities and big brain projects around the world. This is important for everyone because the work we do at INCF touches on many ne neurological diseases that are studied with imaging or recording of the nervous system and its activity. Fields such as cancer, cognitive disabilities, neuroinflammatory diseases like multiple sclerosis, or neurodegenerative diseases like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's. Improving neuroscience benefits humans all around the world. Our vision is a world where every neuroscience researcher has easy access to all the data they need, all the tools they need to work with it, so that they can co collaborate widely and make faster progress in this important field. Our projects are sourced from our community members worldwide, so we usually have a wide range of different projects, from front-end development projects in JavaScript, to back-end projects in code repositories of Java, Python, and C++. Projects can range from big data analysis and visualization, to simulators, to machine learning, to image processing. Our projects vary a lot between the years, depending on which of our community projects that take part. You can scroll through our previous project list to get a better idea, reach out to me or my secondary org admin, Arnon Banneri. We highly suggest that you sign up for our Neurostars portal, neurostars.org, where we put our project ideas each year and you can also interact directly with the members. In general, it seems that GSOC is a driver for innovative projects in our community. For instance, we've seen a big increase in deep learning related projects over the last year. The first ones were really pioneers in combining neuroscience with machine learning, and it helped a lot that there were contributors that already had this expertise. One of our GSOC students from 2018, Arna Banerji, he became a mentor the year after, and then he asked to be my core org admin, and he's been with us since then, and his experience and his perspective as a contributor has been very valuable to us. Most of our mentors are seasoned open source tool developers. They will expect you to be fairly self-driven, but to come to them regularly for feedback and for support, especially if you get stuck. If you go in with some knowledge of neuroscience or a strong interest in learning more, it will be helpful for the bigger context of what you do, but it's not an absolute requirement. Some background knowledge of coding will of course be necessary, and you will need to know how to work with Git and GitHub. We usually have a big range of project difficulties, so it should be possible for any contributor to find something that's a bit of a challenge, but not too much. We look forward to meeting interested contributors and helping you find the perfect project and the perfect mentor for you. Hope to see you later. Bye.